Rosie, are you getting... Listen to me. Look at me. Did you do... What did you do, Rosie? Rosie, look at Mommy. Look at me. Up here. Look at me. Did you run out? Did you run across the street to see the neighbors without permission? Don't you dare do that anymore. And don't wag your tail. You're being punished. Yeah. Dogs. And she's normally very good about that. But something... I don't even know what it was. But it, she ran right between... Yeah, she ran right in between the cars. Like... Out of the clear blue, of course, because that's a dog for you. Anyway, and uh, I, I ran after her, and she's like on her way to the neighbor's house across the street, which when she heard me scream at her, she came back. Oops. You, you need to learn a lesson. Now, why don't you go pee-pee in the yard? Hurry up. Go on. Go on. No. Come here, Lily. Come here. Usually they're such well-behaved puppies. But today, Rosie gets some kind of hair up her little butt. Come on, Rosie. Come here, Lily. Okay. Anyway, enough of that. Look at the sky. Isn't it pretty? Yeah, sitting here under my pecan tree. It's Monday, and it is, I don't even know what time it is. Oops. One o'clock in the afternoon, and I've hung out home most, well, the whole day, really. She got me so freaked out. I'd hate to have anything happen. But I hate to keep them all tied up, you know, on leashes constantly. Unless we're going for a walk. Rosie, I love you, baby. But don't freak me out. Oh, well, anyway. Usually, she's a good girl. And Lily's most always good. Although she does like to run around real fast. You never know. I do take chances, but I just feel like it's the only way to live is to take chances, I guess. I don't know. They still sell snow cones right there. Only in the summer. I've only had them once. It was nice. Not crazy about it. Chickens are really quiet. Let's zoom in on the chickens. Look at Lily, my little sun worshiper. She goes right in the middle of the lawn and just loves it. Little precious girl. I think she noticed me taking photos. <laughs> I let the dogs out. They're, they're not really doing anything, just hanging around. I love to have them feel free. There's Rosie. Hey, Rosie. What are you doing? Huh? Are you sitting in the sun? Yeah. Yeah, I am ch chillaxing, as they say. That's what I'm doing. I haven't got any makeup on or anything. I do have lipstick. I always wear lipstick. 
I don't even know why anymore other than it makes me feel like I have more color. It's nice out. It's, it's warm. But it's not terrible and I guess the humidity's down. Yesterday was kind of humid and sticky. Well, looking at my dogs. I love those kids. Anyway, I don't know what life would be without puppies. I've always had a dog, just about always in my life. Yep. Talk to you guys later. Good afternoon, YouTubers. Everybody out there in YouTube land, I hope you're doing good. Um, I am here with you. It is, what is today? Today is Wednesday. Right? Yeah. Yeah, Big Brother's on. That's right. Wednesday. Um, and it, it's almost time to watch Big Brother, uh, although we DVR it so I can watch it later. And tonight, Kathy and I um, are going to watch Big Brother at her house together. And uh, that's pretty cool. Mark, is, her husband Mark, um, is working at Bud's helping out there. So we have a ladies' night and we're going to enjoy Big Brother together. That's my big, huge plans for the night. It's been really hot. I mean, like, you know, when it hits 97 to 100, um, it's just like an oven. I'm, I don't spend a lot of time outside because it's too much. But anyway, I'm okay with that. I just, uh, it's only another couple months and then it's back to good weather, so... This next month should be really hot here in Texas. Hi, YouTubers, friends and family. RV Debs here, and uh, it is Thursday, and it's been quiet. Really haven't had a lot of stuff to video, but thought that I would at least say hey and hello today. Uh, I did a little videoing here and there, so I'll include that. Um, or you'll have, you'll either have already seen it or it's coming up one or the other. Um, but anyway, I have been a pretty busy day. We went to, um, Stanford and got some groceries and what else? And that was it, but that was enough. And then came back, took a shower and, uh, I've been watching well, I've been watching Say Yes to the Dress. <laughs> Crazy shows. Um, I can't remember what else. And watching videos. And somebody was talking about, you know, the pros and cons of um, having a van versus having an RV. Um, James, his name is, from Wanderlust Estate. Uh, and he, he's lived in both you know, big RVs and and vans. And I'm thinking that I do have my RV, but it's parked. And this is my little house. This is my tiny home. I don't plan right now anyway. I don't plan on moving it. But I do want to do some traveling. So I've got my Chevy Avalanche, which is a beautiful truck that was has been very well taken care of. I'm thinking about selling it, and uh, after I sell it, then I'm going to buy a van. And I've seen one that I really, really liked, but I'm, it's probably already sold. So that's, you know, that's what I'm thinking about. And um, it can happen within the next six months. I'm not in a major hurry, but I would like to, I would like to get going, and I want to see uh, a few places. Uh, so, and, and I really think it's the best way for me to have my dogs with me um, it wouldn't be full-time home but it would definitely be something I could do for a month or maybe a week depending on where I went but I have some dear friends in California uh, and not more than more than one I mean a few and then I have some really dear friends uh, Chris she lives near Seattle I also have never been to New Mexico, so I would really like to see Sedona or at least somewhere in that area. Um, I just want to get 
going and doing stuff and I can't afford to stop at hotels and eat really nice every night out and I don't like leaving the dogs that much anyway in the van I mean in the I don't I never leave them alone so I'd have to work something out but anyway I am thinking seriously thinking about getting rid of my truck and replacing it with a a van and the van can be I'd like to be able to stand up in the van but I am also open-minded to you know just a regular van that's maybe a conversion van or something that's very reliable and so that's that's what I'm thinking about it's kind of exciting and he was saying like the difference you know because in a van you can go to places that you can't really go comfortably in a big travel trailer or a motorhome that's not really what I need to do anyway I mean where I go is really just to friends but on the way I would stop um, you know and, and do some camping I'm just I'm just wanting to you know save money on hotel bills and uh, be discreet about it yeah I've watched so many van videos I watched so many RV videos before I bought the RV. I mean, I was into it. When I get into something, oh my gosh, I go all the way. So I dissect it, you know. And uh, I'm, I think I've come to the conclusion that although I love my truck, and I, it probably will be worth a lot more than the van I buy. Because I don't think I would like to have a little extra money to fix the van up and you know, buy what I need to make it comfortable. Um, so we'll see I have a, two, it's a 2007 Chevy Avalanche and it's an LTZ so I gotta figure out the value of that and it's it's loaded and it was Mark's my husband's and he it it's like the Cadillac of trucks it really is comfortable and you know the seats are are heated and you know it's it's loaded anyway that's what I'm thinking about right now. And uh, I got a big old glass of ice, which I don't normally have ice because my freezer is so small, but Kathy gets ice. So I put some ice together. Oh yeah, ice cold soda. So what do you call it? Okay, that's a Diet Coke. I call it a soda. What do you call it? Do you call it a Coke? Do you call it? Um, what else do they call sodas? Pop? Do you have any pop? I call it soda. That's what's going on anyway. I gotta put my hair up. I, I just, you know, can't take it on my... I'm, sometimes I just want to cut it really short. You know, like, not well, I go through like this. Should I cut it to about here, you know? just all one length or should I really go for it and cut it real short in the back and maybe you know really wear it short it's my dilemma <sighs> anyway friends I hope you're feeling well and uh, that you're all comfy today and had a good good week so far can't believe how fast the weeks go by so and this weekend is chase my little sweetie he's turning eight and they're having a birthday party on Saturday but I have a date for the day with my friend Larry on Saturday and we're gonna go to the movies and I don't want to face a big old birthday cake I'm trying really hard to stay away from the really bad stuff that I don't want to eat yeah I'm trying to get back on track Excuse me. <coughs> oh, oh, goodness. Anyway, that's me over and out. I hope you all have a beautiful evening. Peace out, my friends. Okay, now it's recording. Now it's recording. Hey, guys, the sunset is beautiful right now. It is. You, can, you can't even appreciate it with on the camera. Yeah, I know. It's going to be pretty later, though. Me, my brother is over there with my Nana in the garden. Yeah. It's a, it's turning out to be oh, a Oh, by the way, happy birthday. Oh, yeah. 
I'm finally eight. You're now. eight yesterday, right? Yeah, I was eight yesterday at uh, nine, nine, seven, nine. Seven nineteenth, right? The nineteenth of July. July, yeah. So happy right birthday! Now, it's the twentieth. You, now you're gonna have a birthday party though this Saturday too. Yeah, because yeah. because we usually celebrate it on family nights. Yeah. So what, what do you did you get any gifts on your birthday? Um. Or no. Are they, they're waiting until Saturday. Yeah, but I did get one gift. What was it? Oh, it's a baseball and a bat. Here, keep on doing the video. I'll go get it inside. Okay? Oh, you don't have to. Say hello. We're good. Say hello to everybody that's looking on my video. video hello, 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 hello. Are you gonna say hello, hello to each one of them? Okay. Okay. And hello, hello. Oh wait, hello, we gotta look at hello, some stuff. Hello. Kathy hello. Just hello. Pick the garden. Oh, no, that's pretty. a nice one. I saw. And I. Guys, this is guys. My I picked those huge ones. I saw those huge ones. I can't wait yes, to see my baseball in my bat. Oh man, that's a cool one too. I love the color. Yeah. And that's and the I got a melon. Dad. You. Sure. What? That's a Portuguese melon. Chase, I want to This one that. here? Uh, yeah, I picked it because. <laughs> oh man, I, that looks that. good. I know. Oh, look at the size of that zucchini. Wow, look at the size of it. Yeah, I know. Say hello to all the people out there in YouTube Hi, land. Did he give you a hairdo? Yeah. I put purple bows in her hair. Did you? They're hair breasts. That's cool. They're bow shaped. And then there's a happy dog because they were they knew you guys were here and they just really wanted to come out and visit. Yes, please sit. So how's everything? In the other yard well carefully when you go get it. Careful. I'll help. Oh, that's fun. I can't wait for it to go down. No, Tanny, stay out of there. Come back. Come back, Tanny Banani. Come back, Tanny. Tanny how about I do it like this? Right I'm now. Because, come back the way you got here. Because if I do it like this, I'm going to hit it and it might go over. Yeah, don't that. go that way. Go so toward, go, way. go like toward there. You know, just don't hit it with all your might because we're not chasing it. Okay, Tanny. Go light. Yeah, hit it that way. Yeah. Hit it that, okay, I'll be, <laughs> that way. I'll be here because I want to hit it. That's a tiny mosquito. I hit it that way, they like to eat. Oh, that's, that's, a, that's a fly. That's a, fly. That's a, a snake bug. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. Guess I can't stay out here too long. Getting eaten up. Hey. Hey, yep. Unfortunately, On I have room. to make this the end. Yeah. Look at Lily. Ah. Uh, she said, that's my favorite auntie in the find? whole world. I'll get it. You sure you can get it. Come on, flies. All right, anyway, I hope you all have a good night. We are, we're just gonna have to go inside soon and watch Big Brother. That's neat. This is dinner, pork and cauliflower, and this is egg salad for breakfast. Don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up.